Hey Gemini, it's Elle here to do a quick little love spread for you guys. I hope that the spring time, especially in the, the United States, is kicking off really good for everybody. Um, I have shuffled and prayed over the cards off camera. Let's get started. I'll save the announcements for the end. So I'm going to pull three cards and then we'll look at the bottom of the deck and see you know, if we can get some additional clarity. Six of Pentacles. Everybody's been getting this. Six of Pentacles. Either there is reciprocity in the situation or there needs to be reciprocity. There's not equality here. Somebody's giving more, doing more. Someone could be waiting for a payout. It's just so much with this card. Uh, someone feels like they're, ooh, I just got, someone feels like they're begging somebody for time or, or energy or love. Death card, nine of swords. Bottom of the deck, five of swords. All right, so Gemini, yeah, something is ending. You having some real anxious thoughts about it, about this ending, because I think there's still love here. You may have been giving more in a situation. It didn't have to be monetarily. It could be love, time, energy, just the 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 gumption to actually make this work. This could be you or the person that you're coming to the reading for, but there needs to be maybe an ending so that a new beginning can happen or there just needs to be transformation in this situation completely but one person can't want to transform and then the other wants to stay the same so don't think that you can just do all the work as you, maybe you have been doing nine of swords you're having some real anxious thoughts sleepless restless nights this person gives you anxiety because you don't know which way they're going. You could be dealing with another air sign, uh, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, or Scorpio directly. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. The bottom of the deck, this person gives you anxiety because you don't know how this is going to turn out. And I think you're trying to manipulate the outcome. Or you want to manifest the desired outcome. That's tough when you're dealing with another human being, right? Um, okay, so you might be... There's an inner inner conflict with the Five of Swords. Not only inner, but there might be outer conflict. You may be um, having real stern words with someone or some or about something. You guys will just want to win at all costs here. Uh, or you're trying to gather information, I'm hearing, because you feel like you don't have all the information with the moon here. Surrounding this relationship, surrounding the, the foundation of the relationship. You don't know nine of swords you don't know where it's going you don't know how it's going you don't you just you, you're in a complete not know um and it's making you very anxious making you very hostile because there's things working behind the scenes that you don't even know about um there could be secrets lies and half truths around a relationship home life uh, a message will come in a message that calls you to action it looks like you take that action with the page of swords you give some stern word the page of sword doesn't do this isn't a whole four letter pay four page letter or uh 10 20 text messages this is this is this is blunt this is straightforward because you feel like you were backed into a corner nine of swords ten of swords it's finally over you got the message that you needed to go ahead and cut a situation out or off because there was betrayal but it looks like there'll be victory here for you or maybe there's somebody around you who likes a lot of attention a lot of self-promotion or there might be promotion in in for you at a in terms of a job or job well done with the eight of pentacles and the six of wands nice and just choosing to check out of a situation emotionally just check out because for other people looking in on from the outside it looks like a good situation but you know with that moon here you know the truth could have something to do with the capricorn virgo taurus yeah you're looking at it to see how much time effort love you put into this but it's just not growing not growing in the manner you want it to grow in so you may be having some communication about the trouble in your relationship or there could be the messages of love back and forth you may be contemplating just getting out there dating or a reunion messages of love here messages of someone wanted to actually start something solid with you uh but they might be a little bit closed or you may be closed 
All right. Um, yeah. Gemini, something's got to end so that you can get to happiness, so that you can get to fulfillment. And it may be, it might be something that has to end with you. Something you're doing, something you're not doing. I don't know. Um, but something needs to end so that you can get to true abundance within yourself for self. Um, I think you keep trying to carry a situation along with you and you might need to let it go. Uh, yeah. Okay, so Gemini, if this resonated with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. Request a personal reading. Uh, all information is below. Uh, follow me on Insta Go, Instagram. What else? Fund the page. Click the GoFundMe link. Any donation of any amount is acceptable. Uh, remember, Gemini, when in doubt, pray. I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. I'll see you guys in the April mid-monthlies, okay? Take care, guys.